Coronis photon, Russian Coronis photon, also known as Coronis photon, complex orbital observations near Earth of activity of the Sun photon, was a Russian solar research satellite. It is the third satellite in the Russian Coronis program and part of the International Living with a Star program. It was launched on the 30th of January 2009 from site 32 halves at the Plesetsk Cosmodrome aboard the final flight of the TSYKLON3 rocket. On the 1st of December 2009 all scientific instruments on the satellite were turned off due to the problems with power supply that were caused by a design flaw. On the 18th of April 2010 the creators of the satellite announced it was lost with a good deal of certainty. Overview The goal is to investigate the processes of free energy accumulation in the Sun's atmosphere, accelerated particle phenomena and solar flares, and the correlation between solar activity and magnetic storms on Earth. Launch occurred successfully on 30 January 2009, and the first batch of science data was downloaded from the satellite on 19 February 2009. The satellite operates in a 500 by 500 km by 82.5 degrees polar low Earth orbit and was expected to have an operational lifetime of three years. It developed power system problems during the first eclipse season, about six months after launch, and contact with the satellite was lost on 1 December 2009. The satellite returned to life on December 29, after its solar panels received enough light to power its control systems, but attempts to revive the satellite failed, and the satellite is considered lost. On 5 July 2009, Coronis Photon's TESIS telescope registered the most powerful solar outburst of the year so far, lasting 11 minutes, from 6.07 to 6.18 Greenwich Mean Time. Solar X-ray peak intensity reached S2.7 in a five-level scale used to classify solar flares. The last equally powerful outburst occurred on 25 March 2008. Development <inaudible> 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 Coronis Photon is a successor to the Coronis F and Coronis I satellites, launched in 1994 and 2001 respectively. It is being operated by the Russian Federal Space Agency, the Moscow Engineering Physics Institute and the All-Russian Scientific Research Institute of Electromechanics. It was built using a bus constructed for Meteor M weather satellites. Coronis Photon also carries three Indian Röntgen Telescope or RT instruments RT 2, S, RT 2, G, and RT 2, CZT. These will be used to conduct photometric and spectrometric research into the Sun, and for low energy gamma ray imagery. These instruments will be operated by the Indian Space Research Organisation and were constructed by a collaboration of the Vikram Sarabhai Space Centre, Tata Institute of Fundamental Research and Indian Centre for Space Physics. Instruments <inaudible> 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 The satellite's scientific payload includes an array of 12 instruments. Eight instruments were designed for registering electromagnetic radiation from the Sun in a wide range of spectrum from near-electromagnetic waves to gamma radiation, as well as solar neutrons. Two instruments were designed to detect charged particles such as protons and electrons, scientific instruments, Natalia 2M spectrometer MIFI, Moscow, Russia RT2 Gamma Telescope TIFR, ICSP, VSSC, India. Pingvin M Penguin polarimeter MIFI, Moscow, Russia Konus RF X-ray and Gamma Spectrometer EOF Institute, Russia BRM X-ray Detector MIFI, Russia FOKAUV detector MIFI, Russia 
TESIS Telescope, Spectrometer FIAN, Russia, with Sphinx Soft X-ray Spectrophotometer, SRC PAR, Poland Electron M Pesca Charged Particles Analyzer NIIYAFMGU, Russia STEP F Electron and Proton Detector Kharkov National University, Ukraine SM8M magnetometer NPP Geologorazvedka, MIFI, Russia Service Systems SSRNI Science Data Collection and Registration System IKI, Russia Radio Transmission System and Antennas RNIIKP, Russia See also 2009 in space flight Coronas I Coronas F